Hello, this is Dee from dmiddleton.com. Welcome to my year-long Thorough Declutter series. In this series, we declutter 30 minutes a day, five days a week. Currently, we are working in the entryway, foyer, and mudroom. Each day, we do a daily declutter task based on the room we are working on. Today, our task is to declutter keys and keychains in this specific area of the home. If you're anything like me, you probably have a collection of keys and keychains that has grown over time. Maybe you have keys to your house, car, office, gym, and more, all jingling together on one keychain. Or perhaps you have a few keychains with different keys on each one, making it hard to keep track of what goes where. Either way, it's time to declutter and organize your keys and keychains. Here are a few tips as you begin to declutter your keys and keychains. Step one, gather all of your keys and keychains. The first step to decluttering your keys and keychains is to gather everything together in one place. This will give you a clear picture of what you have and help you decide what to keep and what to get rid of. Step two, sort through your keys and keychains. Once you have all your keys and keychains together, start sorting through them. Keep the keys and keychains that you use regularly and get rid of the ones that you haven't used in a while. If you're not sure if you'll use a key again, put it in a maybe pile and come back to it later. Step three, organize your remaining keys and keychains. After you've sorted through your keys and keychains, it's time to organize the ones you're keeping. You can or organize them by category, such as house keys, car keys, office keys, or you can organize them by keychain. One keychain for house keys and one for car keys. Step four, label your keys and keychains. To make it easier to keep track of your keys and keychains, consider labeling them. Of course, never use a home address. You can use key tags or labels to mark the keys with the name of the place they open. For example, label one key house and another key car. This will make it easy to grab the right key when you need it. Step five, keep it up. Decluttering and organizing your keys and keychains is an ongoing process, so make sure you keep it up. Set aside time every few months to go through your keys and keychains and get rid of anything you no longer need. By following these steps, you'll be able to declutter and organize your keys and keychains easily, and it will make your life so much more manageable. With a little effort and some labels, you'll be able to keep your keys and keychains organized, making it easy to find the right key when you need it. How is your home organized? Are you looking to eliminate the clutter for good? I designed my year-long thorough declutter series to help you slowly and permanently declutter your entire home. What you can expect. You will receive a daily declutter task via email for the specific room we are working on. We move step by step through the process to declutter every room and every space in your home. Leave a comment below and let me know what you are decluttering today. You can also head over to dmiddleton.com to subscribe and get your free homemaking ebook. There you can find my declutter printables and deep cleaning printables over at dmiddleton.com. Thank you for watching.